Parade Plaza. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is American Airlines Flight 1102, nonstop service to St. Louis. Your flight crew for this flight is Captain Dave Coblet. He's assisted in the cockpit by First Officer Kim Pearson. Captain Coblet has informed us that our flying time from Chicago to St. Louis will be a quick 44 minutes. We will be traveling at an altitude of 28,000 feet. Current weather conditions currently in the St. Louis area. <laughs> Partly cloudy, they have a temperature of 73 degrees Fahrenheit, that is 23 degrees Celsius. Now, if you would please direct your attention to the video. To the flight attendant aisle for a brief but important safety demonstration. Please be sure your seatbelt is fastened. To do this, insert the metal fitting into the buckle, pull on the loose end to tighten the belt. To fasten the seatbelt, lift up on the top portion of the buckle. U.S. law requires compliance with lighted and posted signs and crew instructions. All flights are not smoking. This includes e-cigarettes. It's against the law to tamper with, disable, or destroy the lavatory smoke detectors. The safety card in your seat pocket explains the safety features of this airplane, including the location and operation of exits and flotation devices. This airplane has four window exits over the wings, two exit doors in the front, one door near the back, and a door in the very back of the airplane that may be used if opened by a flight attendant. All door exits have evacuation slides to use in an emergency. When directed to exit, jump onto the slide and move away from the airplane. In a water evacuation, the exit door slides can be detached and be used as flotation devices. All exits are clearly marked with signs and opening instructions. If needed, exit path lighting in the aisle will illuminate near the floor to guide you to an exit indicated by signs and lights. Keep in mind, the closest exit may be behind you. In the event of an emergency, leave all belongings and proceed to the closest usable exit. And in the unlikely event that we do experience a sudden change in cabin pressure, the mask compartment located above your seat will open automatically. When this happens, quickly reach for the nearest mask. Pull it firmly towards you. This action starts the flow of oxygen. Cover your nose and mouth with the mask and breathe normally. Put the elastic band around your head to tighten the band. Pull the elastic tabs located on either side of the mask. Even though oxygen is fine, the plastic bag does not inflate. In a water evacuation, you can use your seat cushion for flotation. Pull up, the, pull up to remove the cushion and take it to the closest usable exit. When exiting the airplane, place your arms through the straps and hug the cushion to your chest. We do thank your attention. After takeoff, we will be coming through the cabin to serve you beverages. Now we do ask that you sit back, relax, and enjoy the flight with us to St. Louis. Flight attendants, prepare for takeoff. Thank you. 